hi guys welcome back to my channel please like share and subscribe and also hit the notification bell down below so you don't miss out on any future uploads welcome to a 4 a.m school morning routine and today i'm going to be showing you my ideal morning routine like the way i want my morning routine to be it, it hasn't been like this like there are same things that I want to inculcate and I want to add into my morning routine. So today's video will be about what I want to inculcate and how I want my morning routine to be. So first off, I start with making up my bed and waking up early. This is um, after 4 a.m. So making my bed. The next thing I want to do is to pray. But I'm going to do that when, while I'm doing Bible study. So right now, I want to journal. So, yeah, basically. Oh, and today I'm going to be resuming school officially. I don't know whether I said this before, but um, I'm doing extension. I did extension classes. I didn't have Easter break. So, yeah, I'm going to be resuming officially today. So basically this is how I journal. So first off I start with building a line at the beginning of the book, writing down the dates, the, the date, the day of the week and the time. Then um, I start off by brain dumping like morning pages and after that I do some morning general prompts. Then when I come back from wherever I went to or where I would go. I usually journal what happened in the day and what I want to do in that day and everything. So I use these journal prompts before, like a morning and evening journal prompts, and I also reflect on everything that's happening in the day. And before that, I start with like morning pages. I just dump down everything that I'm thinking about throughout the night and everything that happened and uh, what I want to do in the day.
so hi guys it is 4 43 a.m now and i want in i want to go into bible study so um bible study slash bible journaling so i really want to go into bible journaling and i really want i want to watch a video on that so before i start into my bible study so yeah that's the next thing on the agenda also one of the things that i wanted to inculcate into my whole morning routine was to exercise but i don't think i want to like inculcate that now because i don't want to put too many things right now that i know i will not be able to accomplish because if i i take a very long time to do my bible study and then put in exercise and then all that stuff but then maybe after maybe during the holidays i'll try to inculcate it and to see what i need to match up when i like resume again for school yeah oh hi guys so i finished doing my research on bible journaling and um yeah i've gotten enough, enough information at least so it's 4 55 a.m so basically um what i'm going to use for bible study i'm going to use my tab so i have this plan on the bible digital bible called U vision so basically i have two plans on seven days of prayer and salvation two different plans so um, i'm just going to use the soap method of bible study and i also have this bible template bible study template that i got from pinterest and let's see how it goes also i'm using an niv version of the bible So I'm done with Bible study and what I learned from today's message is that we should rethink prayer, we should um, take prayer with God as 
talking to a close friend or a close relative or talking to like the way you talk to a close friend or in your close relationship whether it's like whether your best friend or something like that and prayer is a two-way communication with the god where you're talking to god and you're also listening to him as he's responding to you and um and you need to listen as you're praying because as you're talking to god you need god to respond and you need to pray to him to be able to hear his words and um we should pray like in every circumstance and be joyful always we should pray in the difficult times we should we should we should, we should, we should also pray in the good times as well and we should give thanks in all circumstances and um we shouldn't just pray to god just because we're in need and then after he has helped us we don't pray as much when it's in the good times we should pray every time and we should keep an ongoing conversation with god so right now i want to go and brush my teeth and bath and i'll see you guys in a bit So right now I'm going to get partially dressed and going to eat breakfast then later I'll wear my uniform and then um, I already packed last night for school so that'll be the end of the morning routine then but bye for now. Also, they don't allow scrunchies so if you want to like put a hairband like here it has to be either black or deep blue so I'm going with black Too much, let's see what it's too much. 